on today we go hp this is called probo 450 g5 model so we will show you how to master reset this laptop in two different way so let's say example this one i sold it out already and i got a lot of personal data and before i ship it i must need to reset it to the default okay so the first procedure make sure the charger is connected because it's gonna take a while so first of all let me show you the easiest way how you can master reset your hp pro book almost any pro book which is uh, installed with windows 10 or windows 10 pro okay so hp got unique style to recover the system what are you going to do we're going to press the power button okay and then immediately we're going to keep pressing f11 okay so f11 would take us to the factory recovery mode okay so this method is really helpful in case if you forgot your password and if you want to reset it okay so once you press f11 it would take you to this option from here if you go to the troubleshoot and hit enter then you can reset your pc okay so let's reset it now there are a couple of options one of them if you want to keep your file then you need to choose this option and if you want to take out everything completely fully cleaned new system then you must need to click in here so that's the one procedure i'm not going to go into it this is just for the example i'll show you the different way how you can do that okay so this method is really helpful if you forget your windows administrative password then you can reset your system now let's say you know the password and first you want to see which data that you have and after that you would like if you would like to reset it you can so we're going to turn it off first and this is the power button there is no light on the display i mean on the keyboard as well so it seems it's turned off so i'm going to start up the machine turning on by the way this one has uh, core i7 8 generation processor uh, this is one of the fastest laptop from hp probo okay so now as you can see i go access into the main administrative account and i can see that this is my data and I realize I don't need anything so I want to reset it now how I'm going to do that okay so Windows 10 made it easy what are you going to do we're going to go to the left hand side corner on the bottom and we're going to write it down reset R-E-S-E-T once you type reset the Windows would suggest you reset this PC we're going to click in here okay and now there is the another reset option click here get started okay still two option one of them to keep my files another one to remove everything so let's say if we have any windows based problem let's say if it become very slow or if the windows is behaving unpredictable then what you can do you can keep your files and reset it so in that way it would back to the factory uh, mood without deleting your data but if you choose the second one it would remove everything as possible you're going to lose complete your data because of i'm sending it away so i'm going to go for the second option make sure your charger is connected because this is very important and you can't interrupt the process now we started and i'm going to go to next now finally reset now this is going to 1% and this one will carry on up to 100% and then the final process will begin which one will take minimum an hour or two hours it depends on your how strong your PC is what is the configuration is so we're gonna pause the video and we'll see what happened okay so we'll come back on the final stage 
so as you can see this is going up to from 16 percent to 100 and then the main progress will start and there is nothing else that you can do you just need to keep patient and wait until get it done to 100 percent and then you need to activate your system like just keep following read it hit the next 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 and finalize the settings and then your system will be brand new same as like factory default okay so thank you so much guy watching and before i go i would mention one more thing this method not only for probook it's almost for any windows 10 pc and if that is from hp then obviously always by default f11 to restore and recover your system so this one went to 100 percent and now we're gonna select it this is just a standard activation your keyboard is set to do you also type with another no. now let's get you connected to a network just so you know connecting to an now let's get you connected to a network sorry just so you know all right so next up the legal stuff type what you want to name your account that's a hp okay now type a I don't need any password, so I skip it. Just Windows click on next. Windows can save your spot in apps. No. Hey, look, that's me. No. Let's set things up the way you like them. First, choose if you want to use your voice to talk with me and other apps. Now, choose if you want to let Microsoft and and if you ever lose your device here. Next, choose whether or not you want to help Micro and if you want to help improve language recognition and. If you want tips, offers they and talk suggestions a lot, my that God. are finally for these settings, choose whether or not you want Your device manufacturer would like your contact details to send you updates and helpful info. Almost done now. We just need to get a few more things polished up for you, and Windows will be all yours. Looking forward to helping out. right so it's getting ready as you can see so guys that's how you master reset your windows 10 based hp probook laptop and this procedure would work almost for almost for every single windows 10 pro laptop if that is from hp all right so if you know any better way leave a comment below and if you do subscribe that would help me to create some more future videos thank you so much for watching and bye for now